Welcome to Sail Tales. My name is Gary. This video will explain how the sail control works to tack the overlapping head sails on Flyer, my gaff cutter. I was inspired to make this video by our friend Ray, who asked, how does that work? The boat uses two sail winch systems. They occupy the same space in the boat, but on different levels, one mounted above the other. Each head sail is rigged with two sheets, one to port and one to starboard. The forward winch will sheet all three head sails. The aft winch will sheet the main sail. Just to avoid any confusion, here are the names that I use for the sails. Above deck, the sheets lead aft, quite like they would be on a full-size boat. That double turning block is just an ordinary block situated to turn the line around to head off the other way. All the blocks on this boat are simple, do-it-yourself, dumb blocks. They have no moving parts. The stay sail and jib sheets join together so only two lines need to pass below deck. We launched Flyer with just the lower sails. She worked well. She tacked but she had a bit of weather helm. I removed one inch from the trailing edge of the mainsail and that fixed it. She balanced nicely. We added a main topsail and she sailed happily that way. Finally, we added the jib topsail to make the rig complete. This clip shows me getting in some practice time. The skipper plays a very active role in tacking this gaff cutter. He's got to be paying attention. Flyer tacks easily in ordinary winds. If the winds are very light or very strong, the skipper must do his part just right. It really is just like Sailing Sparkle, my 35-foot cutter. This is the radio I'm using for the cutter. It's an airplane type radio. Use the right stick, right and left, to control the rudder. The left stick up to let the main sheet out, and down to pull the main sheet in. And I use a channel connected to this knob to sheet the head sails. I turn it to the right, sheets the sails in on the starboard side. Turn the knob left, sheets the head sails in on the port side. I like this radio. It allows me to make endpoint adjustments so I can control the servo travel. And the display uh, has telemetry, which means it shows me the battery voltage in the boat while I'm sailing. I hope this video satisfied some of your curiosity. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Visit our Barrowspace website, where you'll find plans available for all of my RC sailing models. Thanks for watching. Happy boat building, everybody.